So next fight, I do like, and you could get him at a pick em. It's Ricardo Lamas versus Jason Knight. Lamas has fought for the title. His only losses have been to the best guys, and this is a big step up in competition. I was surprised that I, I didn't see Knight as even more of an underdog, and this fight's pretty much a pick em. Were you surprised? It's actually Knight, a big uh, 125 favorite now. When I left the office, they had bet. I'm going to take my jacket off. It's so hot in here. They yeah, had bet Knight up to a minus 125 favorite, and that's when I jumped on Ricardo Lamas. And every time I look at this fight, all I can think about is Frankie Edgar versus Yair Rodriguez. Same division, same kind of situation. A guy coming up, ultra young prospect who's kind of hot. He'd never fought or beat a ranked opponent, suddenly fighting a top five guy. I mean, look at Lamas' losses. Current UFC featherweight champion Max Holloway, Lamas went the distance with him. Former featherweight champion Jose Aldo, Aldo Lamas went the distance with him. He beat Dennis Bermudez. He beat Cub Swanson, who are both perennial top guys in the division. I mean, Ricardo Lamas is for real. You know what you're getting here. And at 35, look, he's trying to be the next Frankie Edgar. Get that third title shot. Uriah Faber, get that third title shot by keep pushing forward. This is a really important fight for him. And he's coming off a really impressive win where he choked out Charles Oliveira. I mean, the biggest win on Jason Knight's resume is, is beating Chaz, Chaz Skelly Skelly. in a fight where he, maybe he was losing, and he came Close. back and knocked him out in the third. Yeah, and the main reason I like Lamas here to pick him is he's a better wrestler. I yes. think of a worst-case scenario, he's uh, not getting the best of the stand-up. He could fall back on his wrestling. He could get takedowns. He could steal rounds. And I see worst-case scenario, Lamas winning decision. Best-case scenario, a knockout or submission. And, and Lamas may not have the output on, it, on his striking that Knight does, but he's has, he has a power puncher. I mean, remember he when he head-kicked Diego Sanchez? And, yeah, he's blasted a few guys out. <clears throat> That's a steal right here. Ricardo Lamas at a pick him versus Jason Knight, or even a little plus money now. Yeah. Yes. I got I it plus 105. I, I, yes, I just I took your advice. I got him before we started taping the show at plus 105. And um, I added a little something to my bets. The only other fight I'm betting, everyone pay attention.